Australia is getting ready. I wanted to talk about the Eurovision fans. Now, there's Eurovision, and there are also the Eurovision super fans. Uh -huh. These are the dedicated followers here tonight. So, yeah, if I am um, rich, rich enough, I'm going to fly to the air. Over the past few weeks, thought I would do a little bit of homework and learn as much as I possibly This will be useful in your next pub quiz. What are you doing? <laughs> Thank you for helping me out. What are you doing? Can I help? I'm trying to buy time. Okay, tell me. Anyway, you might, you might not. I think you made this up. Yeah, that's not, that's that's not a fact. fact. The no. fact is, Australia's ready, so let's cut to them. They're oh. ready. <laughs> they really know how to delay it. Bye. Well, it's, it was like, um, fair enough. Oh, I love this guy, Sharon Sh Sh Riley. Where it is? This is mostly the first time they're showing the modern place in here. Oh. Oh. Never liked the things that I would like. Just look, look at his style, and this vocal is so amazing. This vocal is the best vocal in here. It's like he's saving for it. He's saving his vocal for the show. Yo, that sounds so amazing. Between Laura and Mika. Oh, a bottle in here. All right, are you having fun, Europe? Yes. Good. You know what the beautiful thing about hosting Eurovision is? Is that no one is listening to what I'm saying. Everything is being voiceovered by hosts from all over the world. I just have to make sure I don't. 